Anyhow, this is my cue. Um, this is a message. There's some sort of a new beginning happening in some sort of a situation. Um, but this is my cue to stop and start pulling the cards, what your person is thinking, feeling, feeling about the situation. And do they want to make it work? Near future, most likely possible actions this person could be taking. Final outcome. If you would like to book this reading, it's on my website called the 18 card spread. Okay, so the over overall energy is definitely uh, some sort of a message of love could be coming in. If you have this person blocked and, you know, maybe just unblock it. Okay, maybe just unblock it. Seriously, there's some sort of uh, interference possibly with this person coming towards you or messaging you, maybe to tell you, hey, I want to have a new beginning or maybe, um, hey, I, I have a new beginning elsewhere. I'm not sure, but why not hear it, right? Okay, so let's get the message for Libra. I hope, right? But we'll double check. Okay, Libra. So your first message here, we have in your person's thoughts, strong, I want to be with this Libra. <laughs> That's literally the message. So if something ended, this person's been watching you or they're seeing that you're extra beautiful, strength, your strength, um, you're coming up as very Leo energy, I got to say. I mean, yes, you could be dealing with the Leo, but your person's thoughts in regards to you are, I want a new beginning with Libra, okay? Uh, it's it's just simple. It's plain and simple as day. It's as clear as day. We could say they're seeing your light. They're seeing how bright you are. They're seeing you shine with or without them and nothing more attractive than that, right? So feelings for Libra. So this person has spent a lot of time trying to understand their feelings. This tells me possibly you've been in separation or communication has kind of been a little bit weird uh, because this person was trying to figure out, like, why do I have these feelings? Why can't I stop talk, thinking, talking, uh, watching my Libra? You know what I mean? Why do I feel so much of this emotion? I'm not used to possibly, right? There could be like something breaking through in this person and the love that's coming through is just so strong. Um, so in this person's feelings with the Ace of Cups, boom. I don't know why I just did that. See, it's already come. I, I saw some of the Americans on TV doing this little hand sign here and it's already, my brain's already picking it up. Gosh. Watch what you watch, okay, guys? Anyhow, moon card here. Um, definitely dreaming about you. Definitely dreaming about the intensity of this connection with the two fish there. Um, okay, let's move forward. A lot of love here, okay? You could be dealing with Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio as well. Obviously, I think I mentioned Leo, but you're coming up stronger as a Leo energy here, Libra. Okay, so how does this person feel about the situation? If they've told you or they haven't, they truly do want this situation to work. Like they may be really lost in how it's possible because it's such an intense uh, wishing connection. Like this person wishes to have this. This is a beautiful reading so far. It's, it, once you have this, it's like a beautiful reading regardless, okay? Um, this person does care about you. This person does want to work it out. There's nothing better than you. This person may be trying to figure out how can I work this out? You may have pulled back from this person and they're feeling it and you're doing well. You're doing okay at least, right? You're like, you're good. You're good. Um, does this person, so what, how does this person feel? It feels like they want to work it out. Okay. Does this person uh, want to make it work? Yes, absolutely. I just want to take these two cards and throw this one, but I won't because <laughs> I love this deck. The nine of cups and the lovers, um, this person there's no one else like you in this person's life, okay? But there's something here that is not allowing this to work. It could be another person, could be a past heartache, could be a situation that has this person tied up. It could be their own mental issues. They could remember something and play it over and over again. Um, this person could have to break free from that. I mean, we have something new here, so though this may not have to do with this message, I'm hoping that this person is breaking free and having a new start. Any near future actions from this person to you, Libra? I'm excited to see and I'm scared. I want action for you. Okay, it's interesting because we go from the emperor. Let me put it so you see the way it came here. From the emperor to the... Uh, Virgo energy here, the Hierophant, to the Three of Cups. So Libra, what I get is someone you've been dealing with has been kind of stagnant. They have been 
thinking, maybe even conforming to their misery, just accepting being miserable in a situation that they're in. But I do see this person has kind of had enough. So what could happen? Maybe this person like just one day is like, I've had enough of like sitting here, maybe even waiting for Libra to call or, or waiting to figure this out. I just want to reach out. I just want to talk to my Libra, right? We do have the solar eclipse coming up um, December 4th. So could happen around the 3rd or the 4th. But the solar eclipse is not the full moon energy, right? First of all, it happens in the daytime. But second of all, I feel like that would be around the time of the new moon, not a full moon, right? So this may not happen until the next full moon, which would be uh, two weeks after the solar eclipse, so around the 24th. Interesting. Anyhow, this person I do see there's going to be some sort of movement. I mean, even the hourglass is there, right? I feel like this person has waited long enough or been patient long enough or been still a stalemate long enough. This person wants to connect at least, at the least, okay? Um, but I told you there, I don't know exactly when, maybe by the next full moon, not new moon. Okay, final message. Hmm. Let me see how I pick this up. Okay. What do you want me to say here? We have a Queen of Pentacles. We have a Princess of Cups, which is a Page of Cups. And we have a Ten of Swords here. I mean, the Ten of Swords is good in a sense because something's over. Could it be the confusion ends or whatever wasn't able to work ends? Um, I got to tell you the truth. I think that right at this present time, Libra, uh, something can't work just yet. There's still something that does need to end. Now, this could go back to this situation. I mean, if you have a person blocked, well, then obviously if they're trying to call you, it's not going to work. And, you know, I don't want to hear, or like, you know, it doesn't even, when people are like, well, they can do it from this source and this source and this source, why make it complicated? Honestly, if someone blocked me like that, I probably wouldn't go looking for a million other ways to reach out to them, to be honest. I mean, you know, so that could be one of the blockages that has to end. There's something here that this can't work just yet. I don't know if it will um, clear or not, to be honest, right? And you know what, Libra, for you, I'm just going to cut the deck and see what shows up here. It's the Two of Swords. So it goes, and the Two of Pentacles. I can't believe I just... You know, I'm like, give me some more. Give me something better. Let me show you what happened here. Let's show you. I cut one part of it. You have the bottom one, the two of swords, and then I cut it again. I'm like, come on, do better than that. It's the two of pentacles. There's definitely a blockage, and the blockage comes with this person making some sort of a decision or doing something on their own, possibly moving, moving forward. And also, if there's any blockage on your end that you know about, it's time to clear that, right? I mean, you might as well just clear it. Why are you avoiding you know, at least have closure if you don't want this person. But I think you do want this person. We have passion coming out. And I mean, what's this beautiful? It could be your twin. I don't know. You know, I love that card. It looks so beautiful. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it. Well, that's your message. So Libras, thank you so much for being on.